Today I'm talking about the new version of Lucidesk. So what is Lucidesk? Well Lucidesk is a lucid dreaming supplement that I've actually reviewed on my channel before and they just came out with a new version of it which they sent me so I could try it out. The main ingredient in Lucidesk is a thing called Hupazine A which is an acetylcholinesterase inhibitor that basically increases levels of acetylcholine which results in more time spent in REM which results in an enhanced ability to lucid dream. Now I've tried a couple of versions of Lucidesk before this and I had good results with them so I wasn't really expecting much different with this one. In my previous test I just tried out Lucidesk the way it's supposed to be taken. But this time I decided to do things a little bit differently. You see one of the main use cases I recommend Lucidesk and similar supplements for is for beginners who are really struggling to get lucid. For people who are just not having any luck getting lucid I think it's a great way to get lucid. So I thought why don't I set myself up like that? Why don't I make it as hard as possible for me to get lucid so that I can see if Lucidesk works in such a situation. By the way, if you can hear some jumping around in the background, or like grass moving, that's because a blackbird just landed next to me and is going crazy in the background. Anyway, so I set myself up to make it as difficult as possible. I stopped practicing any techniques whatsoever. I stopped meditating at night. I only meditated in the mornings. I cut my meditation time down to 20 minutes, no longer. And on some days I didn't even meditate at all. I took Lucidesk once every three days. And rather than taking two capsules, I only took one, I took the lower dose. And perhaps most importantly, normally when you take something like Lucidesk, you wake up in the middle of the night, you take it, you go back to bed, so it'll increase REM after that. Or if you can't do that, then you take it before bed. But I decided to do something different, and I took it in the middle of the day, because I'd been experimenting with this recently. And so, taking it in the middle of the day, I know that it does still work, but obviously it's going to be slightly less effective than taking it, you know, in the middle of the night. And so I wanted to see how it would work if I did all of those things. So I know I'm making it a little bit unfair here. I'm kind of stacking the odds against Lucidesk here. But I wanted to do this because I wanted to see does the supplement stand out on its own right without you doing all these techniques and so on. So I did that. What were the results? Well, the results were that for every time that I took Lucidesk, which was once every three days, I basically got an average of two lucid dreams. I typically got lucid on the night that I took it, I typically got lucid the next night, but on the third night I didn't get lucid anymore. There were a couple of exceptions to this, nights where I got two lucid dreams or more, and a couple of nights where I didn't get any lucid dreams, but overall I averaged two lucid dreams per time that I took it. So what do I think? Do I recommend it? Yes, I absolutely recommend it. If anything, perhaps a little bit more than before, because now I've proven that it works even in the most undesirable circumstances. Now, if you'd like to grab Lucidesk yourself, then head down to the description below and there'll be an affiliate link there. So if you actually get some, you can give a little something back to Tifro at the same time, because a small percentage of what you pay will go to Tifro at no extra cost to you whatsoever. In fact, at a reduced cost to you, because if you look at the link, you'll see right next to it, there's a code called Let's Dream that'll give you 20% off your next order. So make sure you enter the code at checkout. Anyway, thanks for watching guys. I hope you enjoyed. And if you did, be sure to subscribe for more videos like this one. If you want to support the channel, check out my Patreon page. And if you want to keep watching, pick one of the videos on screen, go watch that and I'll see you soon. Take care.